so often I must say when we're dealing with old people and they're like end of life and you know they're not going to probably survive yeah we just give them a bit more morphine yeah just just a bit more just to be like it's sleepy time And they'd surround them in a circle jerk circle. Don't you try and assume my gender, bitch. <laughs> I didn't fucking endure years of Aboriginal hardship for you to assume, okay? <laughs> my parents came to Australia on a fucking plane, alright? That's bad. <laughs> <sighs> it's gonna be a long game. Yes. But be honest, if you could fuck me, you would, yeah? I would. Of course. <laughs> Who wouldn't? Apparently, my missus. Oh. That's a bit rough. That is, man. I'm, I feel like I'm fucking cocking myself at home, man. Maybe she's sick of you playing with yourself all the time. No, like, I'm pretty honest, man. I'll be like, hey, babe, can I, like, shit in the chest and do a bit of Cleveland? She's like, no, I don't like that shit. It's dirty, UTIs, yada, yada, all this fucking bullshit. <laughs> like, all she doesn't understand is you just put some cling wrap on her chest first, man. I'm not going to shit on her fucking skin. What am I, a savage? Boys, I'm a bit disappointed. You've made me fucking run around with shotguns trying to find your... Oh, uh... Why'd you pick up the shotgun? <laughs> this is not the plan we had, all right? I don't think we, <laughs> we really had a had plan. plan. <laughs> Yeah, we had a plan! I'm gonna fucking beat it off in anger. I didn't get the email. I didn't get the email. I didn't have to drive to jack off today, but right now I'm pretty fucking peeved. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Do doctor's like, oh, don't fucking toss, you got a rash. Fuck that, push past the rash, boys. No pain, no gain, right? They're supposed to feel greedy now. I don't have to fuck this doc's talking about, I'm a retard. Yeah, he's only a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know my body like I know my body. <laughs> he doesn't know how it's like to fucking have a shower and then, you know, try and pull the shit out of your ass with your finger and then message a prostate. Oh. He doesn't fucking know that. There's no medical book that oh. tells you that. Try to fucking manually push out sperm from your, your, your prostate gland. Fuck that, man. He's got no idea. I reckon when we're going to town, you keep talking like that, and I'm sure you'll scare all the guys away. Which is good. No, I can't believe nah, jokes, boys. I'm actually a medic. I'm a sensible man in real life. Of course, I don't know yeah. if I can believe that. <laughs> Look, man, uh, docs are probably the most fucked up individuals on Earth, man. Like, without a doubt. They're either going to be narcissists or obsessive compulsive. Imagine if you just became a doctor because you like killing people. Because I like killing yeah. people? Yeah, you just like failing surgery. Yeah. Wasn't there a serial killer that did that? What? No, man, Wasn't there, a serial... there was a serial killer like a little while back where he would have patients and he would kill them? Like, yeah, there, was one that, there was one that would um, do legal doses and constantly kill his patients. He's loved, he just How likes do you killing do people. Illegal doses and kill your patients. Illegal doses, sorry. Oh, I thought you said, I was gonna say. So often, yeah. I must say, when we're dealing with old people and they're like end of life and you know they're not gonna probably survive, yeah, we just give them a bit more morphine. Yeah, just just a bit more, just to be like, it's sleepy time. Yeah. Do I'd like to think that's pretty humane. Oh, look, it depends on their age, but also if they're you know a dickhead. Oh, that's <laughs> <So> <laughs> some junk junkie who's trying to fucking sell me weed on the side. He, he's going to get a bit more morphine as well. Just to you know, keep him quiet. He's a bit loud. Oh, shit. Oh, dear. I, never, I, don't, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> yeah. Are you boys going to find the car? What's going on? Mate, I was um, going to call the cops. <laughs> yeah! Don't do that. Uh, my name is uh, John Turner. I live in Queensland. Let's go, yes, on me. Nah. What, I don't want what's, that shit. What happens in PUBG stays in PUBG. 
That's the rule, apparently. That's right, it's also like what happens in the operating room stays there, you know what I mean? Once we quick nudge nudge, <laughs> patients need to test. <laughs> oh dear yeah. god. And sometimes it's pretty hard to put that catheter in, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I really do hope that you're not a medic. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I'm just sorry for that poor monsters. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a good bloke, I'm a good bloke. The difference between PUBG persona and real life. In real life, a little bit less seedy, still a bit of a dick, but less less seedy. <laughs> Does it have relationships work in real life? You can still be a little bit of a dick, but less seedy. Look, pretty much, my wife doesn't speak. She's non-verbal because I've pretty much fucking hit her so many times in the throat. <laughs> so she can't really say anything. But I mean, she nods. And she, you know, This cat was just sitting there with an M16, what a fucking loser. Where is there? Uh, oh. left, left side, trick A's, left side of me, so towards that bin. Yeah, he was somewhere on that side. Probably looting me, I suspect. <laughs> 